It's not the right color for you at all. It's definitely too dark. I love the way you're like tapping on my face like a ween. Like a ween? Mm -hmm. Is that how people tap their ween on your face? I mean, it has happened. <laughs> It wasn't like a solid tap, it was like it wasn't like sure. Yeah, it wasn't yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. Hey guys, Robbie D Zip Face here. <laughs> I'm here today with my sister, Katie, uh, in the most awkward <laughs> I broke out really bad. And uh, <laughs> I look great. <laughs> and I, I don't want to put on makeup today. I just don't feel like it. <laughs> she has to get ready because she's going to a function tonight. And so I thought I would do her makeup because I feel like it. Yesterday I decluttered everything that I own basically. And she was over here picking out makeup. We were talking about it. And I was like, let me just do it. Cause she doesn't even really use bronzer or anything. And I'm like, I'm about to change your world now. <laughs> That's what today is. Um, I asked you guys on Twitter to ask us some questions about like us growing up, childhood, and anything that you guys wanted to know from both of us. And we're gonna answer those questions today whilst I do her makeup. So before we get into the video, make sure you guys subscribe. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. You guys can also follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Everything's Robbie D. Christie, and we're gonna get into the video. Okay, bye. Bye. All right, so I'm gonna prime her eyelids with uh, ColourPop No Filter Concealer. Oh, let's answer some questions while we do this, okay? Okay. So, okay, first question's from Kendra. It says here, what feature of your sisters do you wish you could trade her? Eyes, humor, hair, etc." Eyes, humor, hair, done. That's it? <laughs> yeah. Perfect. You called it. Wow, it's really hard for you to think of, huh? Uh, it's yeah, it's a hard one. No, I'm saying that there's yeah, so many Yeah, sure, that we know. Literally humor, probably, because- You are so funny! Like hair. Your hair? Your hair is always fucking perfect, and my hair it is, is so try hard. and wispy. My hair is try hard, try though. Try hard? I look like someone who's like getting ready for prom every day and it's over curled. Always. Oh my god, I hate over curled hair. It's my I hair know. every day. You are such and a And every liar. day I'm like, today I'm not doing that. And then it ends up twice as curly and then I'm at work and I hate my life every day. Thought she was gonna say personality. Little hurtful. Nah, use a bitch. <laughs> uh, Katie says, I seen a snap or Insta story of y'all singing. Is that something that comes natural to you both? By the way, you will have great singing voices. <gasps> Katie! Oh. Yeah, we've been singing since we were tiny babies. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we always just break into song. Yeah, we just have sang for our whole life, so. It just is. But we, because we were in yes. a band together. You got kicked out. Yeah, I remember you did it. You <laughs> kicked me out. Pretty fucked up of you. People can change. And and thank you, Katie. Appreciate you. Instead of conceal, just put tape on. It makes your skin look real smooth. And natural. <laughs> I'm using the KKW X Mario palette, and I am going in with the top middle shade, which is Miami. Apart from Christy, who's your favorite YouTuber? Oh, uh, I know the answer and you're gonna answer it wrong. Why? Because I know you're gonna be like, oh, duh. Who's my favorite YouTuber? Like makeup? No, it doesn't have Just to be. any. I don't, I don't have one. Yes, you do. You, I do? Yes. Give me a hint. Do, 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 do. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh, good morning. Good morning. Rhett and Link, Rhett bitch. Link. They are the only ones that I could, yeah, you're right. Come on! There's my faves. They're both my husbands. They don't know it. Yeah. They may have wives, but we're there. Fuck we're their wives. better wives. Which one? They do don't you know want? it yet. Which one? Red or Link? I don't know. That's a hard one. That's like you can't say that. That's well, we like, don't even have to pick that. It's like asking if you like peanut butter or jelly. They're the same thing. Peanut butter. But they're different. <laughs> no. Oh. <laughs> Easy for you. Yeah. Honestly, I watch a lot of uh, Dr. Phil. <laughs> <laughs> The best YouTuber of all. That's what I watch. I get stuck in this big long Dr. Phil thing. Ow. Like, if you looked at my suggested videos, it's literally, uh, what's that British guy? Sorry. Jeremy Carl. Jeremy Carr? I, I can't remember the name. Really? It's just like the Dr. British Phil. version of basically like Maury. Wow. I I'm learning so proud. much about you. <laughs> not proud. <laughs> Lena says, does she enjoy wearing makeup slash what's her routine compared to yours? Okay, this is a fun one. I love wearing makeup. I will never leave the house without it. The fact that I'm on screen right now without it is slightly terrifying. Use it as therapy. I love to sit in the morning after I drop my daughter off for school and just sit there for an hour or sometimes longer and just do it. Watch Ellen. Watch Dr. Phil and <laughs> Dr. Phil <laughs> and do my makeup. I don't have any idea how Christy's routine is. I don't know what she does. It's Cause like, she doesn't watch my videos cause she's a hurtful bitch. Get in the shower. I use basic soap on my face. It makes my eyes really, really black when I get out. And then wipe it off with a Costco baby wipe. <laughs> <laughs> it works, Kate. <laughs> and then... <laughs> Costco. You were so specific. Costco baby wipe. What's the Kirkland wipe. ones? Kirkland brand. They're best. <laughs> 
I sit down and then I remember that my lashes are next to my bed, so I get up and I go put pick those up and then I wet my blender if I remember. No one ever or I just does. Press it extra hard and hope there's some liquid left in it. That's what I do. Oh my god. And I conceal my under eyes since I'm 33 and I'm old as fuck. I haven't really been using foundation lately because I have mom skin and I work at a job where I can't look in the mirror very often so it always <laughs> looks peely and crocodile-y. So I stopped using it. So I literally just spot conceal. What do you use for concealer? Shape tape. Okay. Garbage. I literally have none left in it, so I'm, I scrape the sides of it with like a Q-tip. I'm so white trash. On a Q-tip? Yeah, because it's almost empty, but that's the only concealer I have right now because the other one I let sit open and it dried out. <laughs> what was it? Uh, Maybelline. I take a little brush that you got me for contour and I dip it into just brown eyeshadow because I'm trash. And then- No, -uh, I'm using brown on you right now. Am I trash? Don't answer that. Well, you're not using it for contour. Oh, for contour. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> I wasn't listening. This is like a taupey brown one. I actually use it in my brows too. I have lots of makeup that Katie, you've given me. Katie, I have me. given you eyebrow products I, left and right. I know, right. I have drawers of it, but I just like to stick to the things that I know don't look like absolute dog shit on my face when I'm at Get with the shit I give you, little dog shit, bitch. I don't know how to use it. Then ask me. I use some blush, incorrectly. <laughs> <laughs> and highlight, I over curl my hair. You okay, you are such a downer on yourself. You are it's absolutely just true. beautiful. It's so okay. true. Shut up. I overline my lips because look at this. This side is very much smaller than this side. Very much smaller? Look it. But you and need then to I not do my eyebrows. Did I say that? And then I conceal those. I do the I fucking carve them out. I know how to do that. I'm talking myself down. I know how to do makeup. Yeah, she absolutely knows how to do makeup and she does a really beautiful smoky eye. Just the technique that I use is trash. No, it isn't. I do a smoky eye nicely? Yes. I told you this about Say what I what do I do nicely? You do a really good smoky eye. That's about it. So yeah, I don't know if that's, that's about anything. it. A full face of makeup. <laughs> full face of makeup every day and lashes. Oh yes, you don't ever go a day without lashes. I put yeah. lashes on her once and that was the end. Yeah. What scared you guys the most as kids? So like, I'm gonna go off of like irrational kid fears here. Chucky. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Chucky was my. Mine was. Most birds. <laughs> Not you weren't nope. scared of birds. I was afraid of the owl that I saw in my window that one night. When did this ever happen? I've known you for thirty years. When we lived by the school. Oh my god! I don't remember living in that house. We, our beds were next to each other. Oh. We had a bunk bed, and then they separated it and put it on both sides of the room. How come I don't recall this? Because I was older and you were oh. little. Oh, maybe that's why. There was a fucking owl in the window. I saw the shadow of it through our sheer little pink curtain and I walked up to the window to like look out of it and then I imagined it turning its head around and looking at me. Oh, so it didn't even actually happen. Probably wasn't even real. <laughs> <laughs> Think about that owl all the time. Okay, what actually scared the you? The dark. Owl? The dark. Yeah, I would beg Christy to let me sleep with her even when I was like 18 years old. It was honestly so weird because I was like so ready for my independence. I didn't care. And she'd be like, Christy, can I sleep in your bed tonight? I'm like, no! I would stand at her door and cry and, cry. and beg, and I'm like, Please, let me sleep in here, I'm so scared! She was so scared of everything, and so we lived in this house that our grandparents, we like inherited it. Christy had a bug net around her bed. Yes, I did. And it was so safe in that bug net, dude. So you were a little scared too? Ah, I was so scared, Katie. That fucking hallway. We have this hallway. What is that, that you just used on my eyebrows so quickly? Well, they don't look great, but, um, oh. but, uh, <laughs> Wait, no, because we had that, that fucking, the breezeway. First of all, I was a witch when I was 12. Yeah, she really did think that she was the fourth. I was the fourth. <laughs> Wait. Katie was like, that is a feather, stiff as a board. We Katie would try four. to summon Marilyn Monroe and Elvis. Why? Like you everyone else. know who they were and I don't care know. about them. Let's see what another question is. Well, I can say while she's gone. What is our favorite thing about each other? Asked by Emily. Uh, my favorite thing about Christy is that she is literally my best friend. Oh my God, I'm gonna cry. Um, she literally would do anything for me and sh I don't fucking deserve it. She's a good sister. She loves animals, loves people, and is just like one of the most supportive people I've ever known in my life. And she's my little sister. So it's, it's humbling and I just fucking, I don't know. I love her to death. And the fact that she does this and she is like, a YouTuber is weird to me because like she's my little sister but she's affecting people's lives in such a positive way and she gives me confidence which obviously I need. I'm gonna see this later. You better put this in the fucking video. Here she comes. Are you 
crazy and stuff that when I'm editing it, I'm gonna be like, this bitch. No. Your kid was downstairs and she said, <clears throat> is my lipstick still on tea? I said, no. She goes, oh, so I've got to put blush on. I've got to put lipstick on. I've got so much to do. I have to put my dress on. Oh. Where's she going? <laughs> to her dad's house, apparently. Oh. So that was the Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil. And this is the Mellow Cosmetics Brow Powder Duo. <sighs> Sorry, I just like <laughs> walked up the stairs. Needs a bit more of an arch, if I'm just being honest. More of an arch? Maybe right, right there. You bitch. It's a little bit like this. A little more? A little bit more. Wow, you really like to be a bitch. Yes, keeps me single. <laughs> yeah, see that spot? Feel that fucking yap. Yeah, that's better. All right, Kate says, who's the more annoying sister? And that would absolutely be me. No. <laughs> me. How are you more annoying in any way? Tell me right now, go. Uh, I make really horrible mom jokes and then there's silence. You don't ever have jokes that aren't funny. I'm a, jo I'm a funny-less joke. Is that a word? It is See, now. I just proved it. That was the joke? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't know. I don't feel like either one of us are annoying because we're both really cool, so. Uh, True. Alicia says, what's your most embarrassing memory with Christy and what's your most fondest memory? Embarrassing? embarrassing. Yeah. Everything we did was embarrassing. Yeah, our whole lives from like age five to 15 were embarrassing. I'm embarrassed just saying my name. <laughs> oh God, I don't know, fondest? How can we have no memories on either way? <laughs> <laughs> I'm never embarrassed by you. I'm never embarrassed by you either. We've never you done know, anything embarrassing You hated together. me when we were kids though. I did not! You fucking hated the shit out of me. Bro. I feel like I was just jealous of you. Of what? My of lack of friends, my no, because I was. You had way more friends than me. Chrissy, Katie, I used to have to drink cups of spit to be their friend. They really didn't like me. I didn't have friends asking me to drink their spit. <laughs> oh, you're lucky. <laughs> Mommy, yeah, baby. Put the See, she's my kid. Where's uh, the product that's not used for this, but I'm gonna use it for it. Oh, you look beautiful. Come in the frame. Come here, get on camera. Okay. Oh wow. my gosh. We gave her some lip gloss today and she's got the Katie Cat lip gloss on. Look she's right into that camera up there. Up here, look at over in there. Oh my gosh. You are so pretty. Come, look at her skin on camera. Yeah, get out of we here. don't like you in these yeah. parts. So I don't have any bad memories of you. Was that what we were answering? Yeah. Was there something we were saying? Embarrassing or fond? Embarrassing. Fond memories is probably going to Hanson concerts. Hanson concerts, concerts yeah. Those really? Those are like the best moments, I'd say. They're just so good. Even, I think that one we went to when we were actually teenagers was my favorite one Me with too. Jennifer. We were cool. We were so cool. <laughs> is that when you wore the beaded spaghetti strap? Absolutely not. That was the, the time oh, that before was the that. the first one? Mm -hmm. What did we wear to the second one? Regular clothes? Probably just like... Handsome t-shirt bitches. We were not sexy. Yeah, well, we yes, we are now. Now I'm using the Tarte Chrome Paint in Top Yacht. But we don't have any bad memories, embarrassing? Not really embarrassing. I, oh, I know, can I guess? Yeah. It's when we had the video camera and you like set it up on the table to pretend like you weren't recording yourself. <laughs> no, that's you were watching a fucking in-sync, <laughs> um, like, Concert wow, I definitely of, didn't know that this was recording me. It was sitting there and she was like sitting like this next to the table and like <laughs> poking her lips out like acting like it wasn't on and then she'd be like Katie and like talk to me. Oh my oh shut up. Yeah, I was like Christy I know you're recording yourself. I like yelled at you. We have that video somewhere. Yeah, we do. I do. I was really mean to you. I know. I remember. You were annoying. I to... was so fucking annoying. <laughs> we, okay, we found this one video and we were like, I remember we, before we started and push play, I was like, God, Katie, you used to be so mean to me. Yeah. Yes. yes. And then when I, the video turned on, I was like, Katie, 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 Katie. And you're like, oh my God, I'm so fucking sorry. Oh, I was like, I would have beat my ass long ago. No, the time I was going to talk about it was <laughs> mom and dad left the house and I was in my cussing phase. <laughs> <laughs> and I wanted to cuss as much as humanly possible. Why? You know, because you can. And so we used to have this little computer program. I'm gonna lift your eyes and do your waterline. They left and we used to have this recording program on our computer and I recorded myself singing a Hanson song. It's called, the words uh, are, fly, fly the, the wings, wings of an eagle, eagle glide along, along with the wind. wind, no matter how high, I'll be thinking of you the whole time. And I sang it. <laughs> 
Fuck the wings of a fucker. Fuck along with the fuck. No matter how fuck, I'll be fucking at you the whole time. And mom and dad found it. Mom and dad found it. <laughs> and they they didn't even get mad at me. They no, just, you know what happened? Do you they know that they played it? Me. Oh my god, they played it for you. That's right. And they yeah, my dad goes, watch this, Christy. And I was like, what is it, dad? And I came I wasn't the there, I don't think. No, I think he just wanted to humiliate me in front of just him. And he brought me over and he was like, what's this? Have you ever heard this? And I just hear myself, fuck the wings, the fucker. And I'm like, how old was I? Like nine, nine eight. Yeah. That was a moment in time. You were a funny kid. Oh, hilarious. <laughs> that was We didn't really share the embarrassment, but that is definitely embarrassing. Yeah, you didn't share that embarrassment with me, but I, I, I wanted to die. Uh, Jennifer says, I would have a hard time seeing people say abusive things to my sister via social media. Have you ever, ever have you ever clapped back at a hater for Christy? I wanted to, but Christy advised me not to. Yes. Because it would just make it worse and give them more power it and does. it wouldn't work. It doesn't matter what a hater says. If you ignore them, it just makes them feel like, oh, it didn't work. But if you reply, they're like, fuck yeah, we got her, bitch. I literally fucking hate it, though. Yeah. I hate it. Don't even worry about it. I do though. Imagine it being me and someone's like, oh, you have a big nose. You're a big fucking loser. You like Katie, I would literally hunt them down. I and know. That's what I'm saying. And you didn't alive. let me. Yeah. But the thing is, is so I have permission. <laughs> no, <laughs> but I wouldn't because, well, okay. It's different <laughs> because it's just different. Okay. <laughs> it's not different. Marcy says, what's your favorite and worst memory of growing up with Christy? I got in trouble. <laughs> I know it. Yeah, you know too. The wise. Christy fucking wrote cursive <laughs> wise. We had this divider wall that my dad built in between the toilet and the sink in our house. My parents didn't know that she was learning cursive, but I knew. <laughs> and she wrote cursive wise. Why? 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 Like 30 of them in a row in pencil no. on drywall. No, not pencil. Well, it dug into the wall, oh, so yeah. it was permanent. <laughs> and my parents were like, Katie! No, no, no. They said, Christy? Did oh, you yeah, this? And I, said, <laughs> and I said, I don't even know cursive. That's right. <laughs> I had to fucking scrub the bathroom wall. <laughs> but then, then, I blackmailed the fucking shit out of her for the next like 12 years. <laughs> no, literally for like the next two years, she'd be like, Christy, go make me a sandwich. And I'd be like, no. And I was like, she'd be like, wise. wise. <laughs> and then she'd go do it. And then, you know, the worst part about this story is that she blackmailed me for two years. I was like, her, I was like, her maid for two years. I would do anything she asked me to do because I was so afraid my parents were gonna kick Turn my the light ass. off. Turn Close the, the door. Yeah. Give me water. Put a blanket on me. Anything. <laughs> no, literally anything she wanted. I was like why? at her beck and call. And she all she had to do was go, why? So then what happened was one day I had had enough of being her maid. So I went to my mom and I said, mom, I drew the wise. And she was like, what? <laughs> and I was like, I drew them. She's like, what are you talking about? I'm like, on the bathroom wall. It was me. And she was like, I don't even care. And I was like, this bitch has been framing me for two fucking years. She didn't even care. Oh my God. I really thought she was gonna Yeah, she kick cared me. when I had to wash them off though. <laughs> I was a stupid fucking idiot. And I decided to write words on the like little leather center of our car seat in the back, but I wrote my own name. <laughs> you were trying to frame me? I was trying to frame, frame Christy. And then I ended up having to scrub the whole fucking inside of the car and I was like, Yeah, because so instead of writing mad. Christy over and over again, she wrote Katie, Katie, I don't know Katie. why. <laughs> Somebody else. And did. I dug it in too. I was like, I'm digging this in forever. Fucking bitch. My own name. And mom came out and she was like, did you write your name in the car? And I was like, no, Christy did it. She's she like, was why, like why, why, yeah, why would Christy write your name? And I was like, damn it. <laughs> Wow. Oh my. Beautiful. You look gorgeous. Here, get behind mommy right here. breathing so loudly? This is hard walking up those stairs, I'll tell you. Here, come behind me. Yeah, right there. Aww. Oh, you did your own makeup? You look so pretty. Wow. You are a beautiful girl. Good job, babe. High five. Wait, I want to show you which one I used. Okay. I used, I used this one. Ooh. Oh, I couldn't tell. Beautiful. <laughs> what a pretty palette. Is that your favorite? You're a beautiful girl. Good job. You're a great makeup artist. And there's a unicorn on this. Uh, yeah, seat. there is. Hold it up. Yep, yeah, there you go. Oh, cool. Oh, mm. I love you. I love you too. Jackson says, hey, Sister Crispy, as a normal consumer slash possible makeup user, how do you feel about all the drama and cattiness of the influencer industry? Uh, honestly, as a regular consumer, I don't 
follow any of that because I'm not a part of the YouTube community, so I don't have a freaking clue about any of the drama, which you could probably say about most people because, I mean, even being as close to you. I don't deal with drama. I don't know any of I know it. about it sometimes because, like, I'm human. I watched Dr. Phil. We already talked about this. I don't know. We, should, we need to bring YouTuber drama to Dr. Phil already. It's a good question, though. I mean, I, I guess... You know, how would you know? What, how do you feel about it people? though? Does it make you think it's so dumb? Yeah, it is dumb, dumb, but I mean, when you get close to anybody and there's close. like yeah, all good. millions of types of personalities, you're gonna have some kind of weird shit happen. And it doesn't involve me, so I really don't care. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't involve me either. It doesn't, it doesn't affect involve me how the like, makeup works. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Drama doesn't affect how the makeup works. That's the name yeah. of my new slogan. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Yep. I'm is that incredible her natural makeup. skin color under there? Yes, it is, ma'am. It's ma fucking white, bro. Why is it so soft? It made my skin soft. Maybe the secret is tape. Tape. Tape your whole fucking face. <laughs> that looks like you concealed. You really? It really? Maybe Look I... Look at that! Did I? No! There's no makeup on that part of my face. What's happening? It pushed my skin flat. Oh my god. Every morning you're gonna have it to do... It changed my skin's color. Why does it look so good underneath? Was it, did it kill it? It's dead. Dude, it looks so good underneath there, like smoother than I've ever seen your look skin at look. at it, look at, yeah, look at that. <laughs> I'm gonna try something. Are we gonna tape my whole face? Tape my nose. <laughs> but I, I'm just, I love that you're just so ever gently pointing out my biggest flaw. You said put it on my nose. You were putting it on my nose prior to me no, saying I was putting it. on your cheeks. Oh, put it on my chin too. Let's put it all over. Okay. If this rips my skin off, how long were those on my eyes though? 20? Yeah. How can we do the rest of my face like this? And I, I really can't. can't. Like it took away any pores or it, any- It like, peeled my skin and put brand new skin on. How? <laughs> look at what you look like on YouTube right now. Oh my God. Dylan says, have you ever, for just one second, felt a spark of jealousy over Christy's success? Mmm, good question. Please let the answer be no. Sometimes I do feel a, like, sometimes I'll think about it and I'll think about it and I'll be like slightly jealous because I'm look at Christy and I'm like, she's successful and she's married, someone loves her and I'm like unsuccessful and no one loves me and- Oh my God, I love you. I know, but it just feels shitty sometimes. But then I think about like, if the things that happened to me didn't happen to me, I would not have my daughter and I wouldn't fucking change any of it. So then that jealousy goes away because we're different people. We are. I'm happy for you. I Thank would you. not change my life at all. Here, let's peel this off and see what I got under here. Nope. It didn't work? <laughs> I don't know. You Maybe can... it needs to be on for like 25 minutes. It's white on your nose. Look at your nose. There is a white square. Okay, is it residue is the question. <laughs> oh, it like killed your skin. There's some kind of it, acid. Look at it. Look what it did. <gasps> There's like a square. I don't like it. I'm gonna get a makeup wipe. <clears throat> my skin looks better in this spot. What's happening right now? Okay, what it is, it has it has acid on it. Acid? I think tape has acid. I don't like it. Is it wiping off? It's red there now. All right, whatever. Back to normal. Tape method, ridiculous. I would love to use the hourglass vanish stick on you, but I feel as if you will not like it. It's not the right color for you at all. It's definitely too dark. I love the way you're like tapping on my face like a ween. Like a ween? Mm -hmm. Is that how people tap their ween on your face? Mm, it has happened. <laughs> <laughs> it just wasn't like a solid tap. It was like, it wasn't like a sure. Yeah, it wasn't, yeah. <laughs> Good to know. Now I know how all big your guy's ween is. <laughs> oh, laugh was over. <laughs> What's her sign? I'm a Leo. <laughs> Leo. I'm going very minimal on your I foundation. I like it. It looks good. Because you said you don't like foundation. My face looks really good on that side. Yeah, it's just like, it just like softens. Softens. It. I'm taking this a little down. Please do, because there's zits and fucking bullshit all the way down that thing. Welcome to my chin. And even though the color is a little wrong for you, once it's blended in, it's really not. My skin is so gross. No, it is not. You have great skin. Huh. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's all it took. Oh, okay, I do. I'm a Leo, I like the attention. Have you helped cover for each other or did you tell on each other? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I, that was not that planned. Was not. I never told on her. I mean, if my dad would blatantly ask, like, did your sister sneak out? I'd be like, absolutely. But he never asked that question, so. 
Good, because I definitely did. Uh, same to you. <laughs> Actually, he let us go out. I remember- You wanted me to get in trouble. You wanted I did want jail. you to get in trouble when you and Brian would hang out and you guys would make out and like- You guys would make out and be sweaty at his house in that upstairs room on his waterbed and- You get sweaty when you make out on a waterbed. So you did or didn't make out? Did. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm, so what, you're telling me that you would tell dad? I didn't tell him, but I wanted to. Alright, well I appreciate your honesty. <laughs> I feel like- I don't remember you. <laughs> you don't remember me, huh? No. I do remember that once you and your friends had a fucking party at our house during the summertime and mom let you have like 10 of your friends over and, and I only had the like- tents? You guys were out in the tents and I wanted to hang out and be like cool but I was not cool at I know, all. you guys kept trying to hang out with us and I was like, is she gonna come in here and prank us? I kept saying that to my friends, I was like- And I really just wanted to us? hang out. You know, I, we, I was like, Katie never wants to hang out with me so there's an ulterior motive. And that's why we wouldn't let you hang out and I remember you got all Because I wanted to be like the cool older sister but it wasn't happening. I was just well, like- Well because we didn't know what the point was. We were like, is she gonna hurt us? Why did I hurt you? Have I ever hurt you? My feelings. No, I'm just kidding. Was kid, a man. dick. No, you weren't. You were just fine. Okay. Do you think Christy has changed over the years, for better or for worse? Tell an embarrassing thing Christy did when she was younger. Everyone wants to hear my embarrassing stories. Oh wow, I see this side of you I never knew before. Subscribers. I'm really, for real. Like be. I honestly honest. think completely. Like I don't think you've changed at all. I think I'm cooler. <laughs> cooler. I feel like I let shit get to me less, and I yeah. used, I'm less negative than I used to be. Yeah. But that's just me answering my own questions. There you go. Changed if she changed at all, it's definitely for better. But I didn't think it was bad then. But I mean, we both have. I mean, this is what happens when you get older. You've been doing this for five years. People yeah. learn things. People grow. You're. But I feel like I'm very similar to how I was in high school. In you're the way exactly that, like, the same. That like I have this, a similar attitude. I'm just way less negative now. Destiny says, "How many years apart are you guys in age?" Two. Two and a half, right? Manny, ow. Um, I am thirty. And I was born in December, and she is 32, Two, born and she was August. born in August. The only notifications I get are my Bible verse of the day. Hey, Jesus loves you, this I know. MX Whip Stitch. If you were going to unfollow Christy on one social media you follow her currently on, which would it be and why? Wow, that is actually hurtful, but I'd like to know the answer. I have no idea how to use Twitter, never once ever used it. Just say Facebook. I'm gonna say YouTube only because I can get all of your videos through Instagram, right? It's in your bio. All your uploads are on your bio. Yeah. Yeah. So technically, like, like, uh, yeah, I put, I link them all in my bio. So technically, I wouldn't lose anything. I like the way you think. Does she or any other family member suffer from cluster headaches too? No. Un, it's weird. I have zero health issues. Yeah, you bitch. Yeah, but most of my issues are mental. That's I suffer from anxiety. Oh yeah. Like nobody's business. I'm constantly worried about everything. I don't sleep very well, and uh, for sure have stomach ulcers and like. Just, you know, regular heartbreak and fucking loneliness disorder. Katie, you're breaking my heart. Yeah, but I mean, those things, we're, our lives are different. You went through different things. Uh, that's just, I don't have Heartbreak is headaches, fucking horrifyingly yeah, sad. It's the worst thing ever. What is, what's Christy's favorite color and food? Christy's favorite color, I think, is definitely black. <laughs> <laughs> Ramen. I love you, yes, you guys. I know right. everything about my sister. <laughs> what's my favorite dessert? Boston, or it's a banana cream pie. Yeah. My calendars. Yep. I know you. You do. I know things. I don't even know those answers to you. I feel like, okay, what's Katie's my favorite, favorite food? food? You know this. Wood fire pizza from the place we like. Yes. And their ranch. Yes. And you're a pizza eater. Like, pizza yeah. is like your food. You also really like Dairy Queen chicken basket. I do. <laughs> <laughs> White trash, I told you. It's what's fun. my favorite dessert? Your favorite dessert? This is tough because I feel like Bubble I Bubblegum ice cream? Oh no. I don't need more. I can't eat ice cream. Why? Because I shit my pants. Really? Yeah. Yesterday, you when we were pants. at the zoo, I had... Diarrhea. Oh, yeah. Like Dylan diarrhea. <laughs> <laughs> Dylan! <laughs> we were standing there getting ready to have Avery get her face painted, and I had a quad shot coffee with extra cream, and I normally drink just two shots or three, but that fourth shot, when I took a first sip, I was like, oh, that's awfully strong. And we were standing there, and I was like, ooh. Not feeling good. My you stomach was drop. like, yeah, I was like, I started to get like a little bit of a fever feeling. Uh oh, that chill. I, uh oh, it, it was, was there. Like, it was just there, but pure liquid. Oh no, did you have to run to a bathroom? Or I did you ran as pants? fast as I could. I was like, Devin, take my money. I have to go right now. Take my money. <laughs> I did. I handed him my whole purse and I just ran to the bathroom. Dairy or the coffee or the combo? I think the combo and heartbreak, all of it into one. Heartbreak. <laughs> oh, heartbreak makes you shit. It your does. Pants. It's adrenaline. I flushed about seventeen times. Oh yeah, it took seventeen courtesies. 
Yes. It's like nothing's happening, but your stomach's just like, you're not done yet, bitch. <laughs> I can't believe I just told a diarrhea story on your uh, channel. You know, that's, you're clearly my sister. Okay, next question. Can we not talk about my poopy pants? Nobody asked about your poopy pants. Oh. Have you or Christy ever eaten a crayon or glue? What strange things have you and your sister eaten? I mean, I've eaten a crayon, probably. Yeah, I've tasted them. I mean, I've them. definitely tasted Chris a crayon. used to take crayons and break them over her forehead. Oh my god, I forgot about bags that. Bags of crayons. Brittany had bags that of crayons, and you would just break them over your head. That explains it. The way I am. The idiocy. Can you outswear Christy? A demo? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Mother, 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 fuck. Mother, 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 one, two, three, four, noise, noise, noise. Smoking weed, smoking weed, doing coke, drinking beers, drinking beers, 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 oh shit. Rolling fatty, smoking blunts. Who smokes the blunts? We smoke the blunts. Rolling blunts and smoking. 15 bucks, little man, put that shit in my hand. If that money doesn't show, then you owe me, owe me, oh. My jungle love. We've been throwing. Oh, we, oh, we, oh. I think I wanna know you, know ya. Yeah, what? How do we both do that at the same time? You just knew. We spend too much time together. We just. <laughs> We didn't plan that, by the way. I want you to see that that just came out authentically. Yes, we didn't did. go, let's do that song. I just looked at you and I knew I just knew it. <laughs> <laughs> Ruthie says, what do you most wish was different about yourself or Christy? I wish I was more confident. I wish I had Christy's confidence. Give a shit. Lessness. I wish Christy would give me a fucking million dollars. I wish I had a million dollars. <laughs> I, don't, I wouldn't change anything about you. I would change one thing about you. What? I wish you could tell people to fuck off. Yeah, yeah. Because a lot of people that you deal with deserve to be told to fuck off. What do you hope never changes about yourself or Christy? I hope that I never lose my compassion for humankind. For humankind? And animals. I lost mine a long time ago for <laughs> humankind. If you want to gain some confidence, watch Amelia fart. I watch Dr. Phil. He is, he makes everything. I watch Dr. Phil. Phil, as if that's what I told you to do. Okay, I up. watch The Most Confident Man. No. Amelia Fart's the most confident man. When Christy and her husband, then boyfriend, started dating, did you think they would be together for a long time? Did you like him right away? What was your biggest, what is your biggest pet peeve about Christy? Um, when they first got together, when you and Zach first got together, yeah, you guys like fell madly in love. Yeah, we did. You guys were inseparable, it was annoying. <laughs> What's this? This is Fenty Gloss Balm in Fenty Glow. You don't like nude lips, so this is the most beautiful gloss that is like pinky tone, like, look at that color. Tell me that isn't like the most beautiful gloss you've ever seen in your fucking life. Yeah, but you need to overline my top lip because it looks like I have just a bottom lip. Well, no, I don't. Don't ever tell me what to do again. You're not my real dad. I love how Avery says that. She says it to everybody. You're not my real dad? She says it to people and they're like, the fuck? <laughs> you look stunning, don't you? I don't know, I don't like it. You don't like any lipstick I ever do on you. That is a fucking fact. You don't like that? You look like a beautiful human being. My face is so asymmetrical. Yeah. Asymmetrical is stunning. That makeup is absolutely the most beautiful you've ever looked in your entire life. <laughs> <laughs> you don't think so? I do, yeah, I like it. I just don't like my face. The makeup looks good. It's the face I don't like. The face? The face is great. Okay, well we're gonna go do her hair off camera and we'll be right back. We got one more question. It was just asked by Miss Samantha Ravendahl. Hey Sam! In what ways would you say Christy has changed the most over the years? Oh, did we already answer that? Has her being on YouTube impacted you, if at all? Yes. I explained this a little earlier when you were not in the room. Oh, you did? Yes. What? Uh, uh, uh you make me more confident as a person. Oh. Don't, I cried a little bit. You didn't! No, I didn't, I almost did. Yeah, it's made me give less of a fuck about what people think, but still do, but I, uh, I'm gonna cry. Don't cry off your makeup. I know. Look at me. I don't know, just knowing that you, cause you weren't confident as a kid either. And like for you to be on this type of a thing and do this and show people that what's inside matters more than what's on the outside. And yes, the outside can be fun to do up, but it's the confidence inside that fucking makes any of that matter. Helps me when I'm getting ready for work every day. Oh, I just love you. <laughs> when I'm getting ready for work every day. All right, it doesn't matter it what I look like. It doesn't, uh, doesn't, doesn't, doesn't matter what I look like. Huh? Inside that counts. <laughs>
look at it. It's good. It was a good time. I feel like you're lying. So <laughs> I just feel awkward enough. It was a really good time. I really enjoyed it. No, I did enjoy it. That's that. I hope you guys like this video and uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe if you haven't yet. And uh, that's that. Okay. I don't really know what to say. I look really red and zitty compared to you. <laughs> this thing is horrifying. Yeah, it's worst. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for watching and uh, I will see you at my next video. Okay, bye. I won't. Bye. Have a good day. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> I keep, it's so hard because it's backwards. I keep rubbing the wrong eye. I mean, I think my eyes are just fucking red like this because I'm old. I look like I've been playing like sports and I'm all like blotchy. Couldn't be uglier. The kid is downstairs saying, Yanny, Yanny. Ew. Laurel. Ew, Laurel. why? <laughs> I don't know. Focus on me. It's weird because you feel like it's live sometimes. Like you do <laughs> feel like they're immediately watching it right now sometimes when you're recording it. No, oh. but I have been doing this for a bit. I just felt like everyone just saw me be awkward oh. and no one's <laughs> even seen it yet. I think we're done. Done? Yeah. Stunning. What feature <clears throat> of your sisters do the- <laughs> I'm not- I'm only funny on edibles. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck them. <laughs> I wish I could. Do we want to wash one? Not really, what we're filming. <laughs> <laughs> and then- <clears throat> I look so swollen today. Swollen? Yeah. Swole. From both our grandpa. died in. The, well, they didn't die in it. Oh, did they? They both died in it. Mm, wow, that's scary. So now my fears are what? Better? Well, yeah, I didn't More know they I didn't know they died in the house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get, um, I need a brow powder, but I don't I have- I need a brow powder. I just a brow powder. Damn. Uh, filling in that skin. <laughs> No, she doesn't want to be in it. She's oh. moving as far away from it as she possibly okay. can. Okay, I think that's great. Why are you putting makeup on to go to dad's? My girl. Who taught you how to poke your lips like that? KT. YouTube videos? Oh my god, you're the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> if the things that had ha- Why can't I be- <laughs> Had ha- if... What have we done? Don't wipe my eyes. Leave them there. Oh, I'm not wiping your eyes. You shouldn't my dick. What was this question? <laughs> <laughs> Angst. Teenagers are pieces of shit. What can I say? Not all of them, but we were. Piece of shit. I should have fucking ran him over. I okay. really should have. Well, I could have if you would have told me this before now. Where's my where's my highlighter brush, Katie? I don't know. We would laugh, but mostly I would fake puke to get out of it. Yeah, she would. She would start coughing really hard and start basically like drying dry up on me. And so I would obviously quit because I don't want to get puked on. Darken underneath your lip. It makes, makes your it look lip booger. Powder. Looks booger. Powder. I said powder. <laughs> <laughs> you don't deserve her. Truths from Christy in the bathtub eating Cheetos. Did you do that? Nope. That's yeah. Amelia Fart. My little the love of my life. Okay. Amelia oh. Fart? Mm-hmm. Her real last name is Fart. Absolutely not. Christy would stuff her bra any chance she got. She wanted big <laughs> boobs. <laughs> this is fact. She literally wanted boobs more than anybody. But you know what's funny? You got boobs and you hate them. Hate them. I'll take them. I just get Rosie O'Donnelly. Katie, they're trash garbage. You have a hair on your upper lip. Can I pluck it out? Mm-hmm. Or do you not do that? Do eyelashes grow out of your face? Ah! Actually, you have like five. No! I swear to God. Okay, boom, fast and hard your face all fucking day long. I don't pick a mustache. You don't? No, I just get rid of it other ways. Deal. Oh! <laughs> it's a good feeling. Mm. Oh. I got that on your tooth, sorry. God damn it, you're fucking me up. <laughs> Cover that tooth with them lips, girl. Oh. <laughs> Look like Grease Factory. No, so you're going the wrong way. God, I know, I know. What the? Fuck. <laughs> Are you putting that thing back on your fucking forehead? <gasps> Can it get us both? Get in, you fucking asshole. People will be like, oh, that's your twin, and we'll be like, I don't see it. What? Okay. Aww. As you just answer my child and she thinks it's me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Love you,